Crane. Listen, Brecken and a team of runners went after an airdrop last night. He lost the rest of his team to biters, and then Riser's men ambushed him, beat him to a pulp, and stole the drop. Now Brecken wants to go after the next drop himself, but we can't let him, and you've got to back me up, okay? For God's sake! You can't even walk straight! We need you alive, you idiot! Okay, we're going in. Act confident. Brecken? Lena? Maybe you can get through to him. Jade, who's your friend? Kyle Crane. Look, Brecken, the last thing we need is for you to go back out there. We can figure out another way without jeopardizing you. Right, Crane? I'll go. I'll do it. Right? Yes? Crane will go. He'll be happy to. Jesus. No offense, friend, but you're as green as grass. You can't just... Crane will manage. He'll start in the right spot. And Lena's right. You need to be here taking care of the towers, convincing them the world's not over yet. Oh, hell. Maybe one more try before we go to Rice. Yeah. Okay, fine. Good luck, Crane. Jade, a moment. Sure. Head for the cauldron. I'll be in touch shortly. Jade, I'm getting close to the drop zone. Good. Find some shelter and wait. Most of the drops seem to fall exactly in that area. And there's a crate. It looks intact. I'll check out what's inside.
Damn it. Nothing here. Did you see that? Yeah, two drops. They landed elsewhere, unfortunately, but you're not that far away. Get to those crates before anyone else does. Jade Rice's men got here first. Fuck. Okay. 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 Don't try to fight them. Just find the second one. Look for the smoke from the flare. The crate should be close by. Jade, I'm almost there. I can do this. Ah! <laughs> 